Alright, hello everyone and welcome back to Medieval Dynasty, where yet again it's a foggy morning. It is always foggy in this world, it seems, at the early hours. But uh, yes, plan for today is, well, first and foremost, as per usual, we're gonna go ahead into town and have a little chat with Erica, and then... I'm gonna go find clay. Now, I did look at some maps online as to where to find clay, and apparently you can find it, like, over here and also over here? So I think we're gonna do this one here that's a little bit away from Gustovia since we're already gonna be in the village to, you know, have a little chat with Erica, get our flirt on, etc. And then go look for the clay. We'll use this one later on since it is... Well, actually, depending on if those map locations are accurate, they're roughly equidistant from my farmland. Hmm. Alright, well still, we'll go take a look at this one first. And what do we currently have in our inventory? Oh, and hey! I meant to check this when we first got into this new season. Our first year was done, and yay, I'm actually happy about this. The things that I read somewhere online were incorrect. We did, in fact, just age a year. Ah, oh, thank crap. I just thought about that, and I completely forgot I even made that point. But awesome! Wonderful. So that makes me happy, and that actually makes me like the current three-day season thing. Since, again, the whole point is creating a dynasty. Find our wife, have a kid. Eventually, the kid takes over, etc., etc. If you had longer seasons and years, I think it'd be a little bit... It would just take way too freaking long in the game to actually, you know take over as the next generation but all right let's uh drop the hammer in our um chest outside hmm current food and water is not horrible we'll eat some roasted meat and yeah yeah let's go drop off our tools excellent oh we do also have the new house oh maybe while we're in the village we'll start talking to someone oh yeah you know i'll keep the axe on me just in case i need to you know, chop down a tree, because who friggin' knows? Maybe our shovel will run out, and we'll have to make another. What does the shovel take to make again? And also, can't I only make it here? Ooh, we'll check on that. Oh, God, two logs for a sh... <sighs> Just... <laughs> some of the requirements in this, some of the requirements in this. Let's see, can I make one in the field on the fly? I cannot! Oh, that's unfortunate. Alright, well, we'll just deal with the shovel we got. Okay, so let's go into town. And I'm intrigued to see how this is going to go. So first, of course, Erica. Then, on the way out of town to find the clay, we will go and chat with uh, one of the hired hands. Since we do have that new, lovely little shack for them. And we'll get them to work as a hunter. Because uh, a couple of reasons. One, free food. Two, I'm wondering, I doubt this is the case, but I'm wondering, ah, oh, she's in there, excellent, if anything they kill gets counted towards my mission, which, also, thank you, commenters, for uh, reminding me what the Wincent is. Some of you actually even told me that I'm remembering. It's the bisons in the world, and when I wondered what they were, and if Europe had bison, someone in the comments actually did tell me their proper name, and I completely forgot about it, so thank you, folks. Thank you. But yeah, I'm curious. I doubt it, but I wonder if the hunter dude, if this will make things count. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, God. I still have to hunt a freaking bear, though. Ugh. All right. Let's go talk to Erica. Hello, my dear. Don't mind me barging into your home. How are you? How you doing, beautiful lady? Okay. What do we got here? This amazing dress you have. It suits you very well. Ooh, she didn't like that last time. You know, I like you a lot. She didn't like that last time, because she was like, oh, this dirty thing? Let's go with this. What the hell? Plus five, yes! I like you too! Yes! <laughs> We're in! All right, you seem very fit, strong like a boar. Oh, God, I still don't know about this one. Oh, dedication to your work. She likes that one. She likes that one. Excellent. We're up to 75. Can I do it one more? Sometimes we get two. Sometimes we get three. Today's a two day. Okay. All right. Well, we're almost up to 80% affection. Oh, I'm so happy about this. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, I'm very pleased. I am very pleased. Also, still don't know what happened to that one quest. I wonder if we missed it. 
<laughs> will we ne will we never be able to do it again, or will it come back around in another season? I don't know. Which how are the other quests? I think the others the one this one is still wait till summer, and that one wait for further events. Okay, I wonder what those events are. And hi, you two. Oh, I wonder if I can get both of you to go there because didn't someone in the comments tell me that if I get a man and a woman in the house, they might marry and have a kid? We can grow our village. That's, you know, down the road from this village. Good times. All right, you first. You're going to be my hunter. Lutabor. Oh, that's a, that's a good strong name. Good strong name for a hunter. Hi, how are you? Uh, I'm looking for... Oh, don't I have to, like, chat him up a little first? Hey, you got a minute? All right, nice weather. Hmm. What a day. I've been working nonstop. And, uh, oh, you know what? Nice weather. We'll go with that one. He approves. Cool. Hey, I'm making a settlement. Is that enough to get you over there? Nope. Oh, needs 70. Needs 70. Okay, got a minute. How's the job? I hope you're doing all right. Wait, I'm trying to hire him. Is he going to be insulted? Like, dude, I don't have a job. I'm looking for one. Ah, uh, I'm going to go with it, though. Hope you're doing all right. Ooh, negative five. He didn't. It's hard and dirty, and I wish I could work in some cozy place like the sewing. Well, too bad. I'm making you a hunter. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, okay. Well, you know what? Let's chat up you two. Hi, Gonzamira. Uh, oh, wait. How, what do I need for you? Also 70. Okay, got a minute. Nice weather? How original? Yeah, I'm out. <laughs> I am... Awful at that. <laughs> alright, alright. So, where exactly are we on the map? I'm trying to see. I think it was like there ish. And I was told by someone in the comments that it's very obvious once we see the clay. So, I'm hoping that it is indeed very obvious. I just need to see where it is. Oh, wait, what's this over here? Ah! That looks like obvious clay. Yes, clay deposit. Cool, shovel required. Let's get our shovel out. Oop, nope, wrong thing. hey -o. Ooh, 80% there. All right, all right, 60. Let's dig up this whole one, see how heavy this is gonna be. And one more. Got it, got it. Oh, we didn't get clay until we finally finished doing the whole thing. Ha, huh. I was hoping we'd get it with each shovel. That was not the case. I also need to eat and drink. I'll eat now. Eh, we'll go ahead and eat the soup. It's 87%. There we go. We'll, we'll drink once we finish this. Oh, God. Okay, so yeah, we don't get any clay until we get entirely through it, which seems weird. <laughs> I mean, if it's just a giant mound of clay, you'd think we'd be getting it with every scoop in three. Three. Oh, boy. Any more around here? Oop, oh, oop, oh, yep, yep, we got more, we got more. All right. Doesn't seem to weigh too much either, so I'm just gonna grab a load of it and then try and make the walls of my house nicer. Because, you know, clearly I need the best house in my little village. Hamlet, really, not really a village, but, you know. Eh. Though apparently you can make things pretty large. I forget when I, I forget what the numbers were, but when I was looking through what, like, future quests are, I'm gonna go grab water real quick what future quests are and the rewards for them, you know, upping the, like, uh, building limit, you could actually make a pretty decent size village in this game. I think I saw, like, 20, maybe more? Um, I, guys in comments do correct me on that, cause, but it was, like, a pretty high number, surprisingly so. I was shocked by it. Considering so far, everything we have seen, which we haven't seen the whole world yet. Why isn't this not... There we go. We haven't seen the whole world yet, but all the villages we have seen have been quite small so far. So I'm wondering if there is like a bigger one on the map or if we're just trying to make the large one. Let's actually take a look real quick. It's down here. No, that's another small little village from the looks of it. Yeah, I mean, looks slightly larger than our current one that we're at over there in Hornica. That one's about the same size as ours. What about Les Lesnica? Another small one. Denica? Another small one. We've actually already been to that one. What do you got up here in Rolnica? Another small one. Also, what is... What is this? Huh? 
interesting. Why are there, like, field-shaped things up there? Hmm. All right, and Branica and Baranica all seem to be roughly the same as the others. Hornica seems to be the largest of the villages here. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven buildings? Maybe more, if, if some of them are in the mix there? But yeah, so it sounds like from the, from the quest thing I was reading, you could really make the largest of towns, which is kind of cool. I like that. Also, oh my god, can I click? No, that, that must be like one of our resource things. Oh, that's unfortunate. Oh well, oh well. I was hoping that might show where we're at with the clay right now. All right, let's go around for any more clay here. Ooh, 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 hello, hello, hello. Lovely. All righty. Let's get this. And how much do we have? And I have no idea how much we're going to need to improve my home. But I want the nicest of homes. I mean, eventually we get the ability to make bigger homes, which, you know, I'll make, clearly. But for now, you know, I have no idea how long it'll take till we get that. So, you know, just having the the most well-insulated home <laughs> without any gaps in the uh, waddle walls would be the nice, would make it the nicest one. Cool. Got any more? I don't see any more. A lot of sticks, though. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not seeing any more here. All right, all right, all right. Well, I'm pretty excited about that. And considering we're a little bit away from the village, I'm actually going to pick these berries. I know it's not the best moneymaker, and they're not ripe yet, but anytime I can collect something to get some easy cash is the way to go. And I am wondering, I need to do the math on this, because people in the comments keep suggesting to keep making the stone knives for, uh, you know, better cash than the stones. And I'm just, I'm wondering on the, the conversion factor there, if it actually is better. Because, like, one rock can become five throwing rocks, and each throwing rock sold for, what, what was it, one gold each? So you can make five gold per rock. Whereas, oh, what was the stone knife? Well, let's take a look at that. Yeah, the stone knife takes two rocks and five sticks to earn 11 gold. Whereas one rock can make five gold. So the resource cost and the time to collect and build actually still makes the throwing rocks the cheaper solution. Compared to the stone skinning knives. Yeah, this is worth one more, but it also includes five sticks in the mix as well that you have to collect. So yeah, that's, that's, that's my thinking here. Yeah, someone, you know, maybe someone has done the math on, like, construction, crafting times and whatnot. Maybe you can uh, give me a better look there. But from the looks of just the simple math there, it seems like going with the throwing rocks is still the best easy way of making money without li with very little effort and resources. But yeah, I still do need to find the best ways to earn money, which uh, people have been telling me that mining ore is really the way to go, that you get good money on that. Uh, which I was looking at a map earlier, and I'm assuming we have to go to caves to find the ore, and there is a cave somewhere south of where we live. Maybe we'll go check that out next time. I still don't have a pickaxe, and I have no idea how we get a pickaxe, as I have not seen one in any stores, but... You know, it's something to keep in mind. Hey, new level of survival! Nice! And I think we have all the points we need in survival right now. And that's another reason to get the barriers at the moment. Survival leveling. Alright, yeah, that's everything. So back to the village to sell. We'll leave these to ripen. Because I don't remember, do ripened berries make one or two gold? Because if they also make one, it might just be worth entirely... <laughs> deforesting the whole area of uh, berries prior to them getting ripe because, eh, if they sell the same, why not? <laughs> Alright. So let's go sell these. I'll be back to talk with you two. What are your names again so I remember for tomorrow? Gadzamira and Lutabor. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Oh, oh, wait. I was gonna... Yep, she's in there. Good old Adelina. Hi, ma'am. I'm gonna sell you some uh, unripened berries. 
for worth 205 gold. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh, we got 30 clay? Oh god, only worth one as well. Ugh. <laughs> All that work for that? Oh Jesus, yeah, and there's not a whole lot of clay in the world. Or at least at that one spot. I, 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 like I said, there's another one not too far away from my village. But yeah, let's go see how much we actually need. Oh, we actually have to turn it into a uh, daub, don't we? Ooh. Huh. Well, let's pull out the hammer. Do I have it on one of my buttons? No, I don't. Oh yeah, I also put it in the, Never mind, it's in storage. I'm just gonna take a look at the walls if it told me how much daub I need. Hmm. So I don't remember from last time. Ah, boy, I'm tired already. Tuckered out. All right. So let's open that. Grab you back out. And put you on one. And then, nope, nope, nope. Wrong thing. Uh, upgrade. Eight daub? Oh, holy crap! How much straw do we... Oh, boy. How much... do I? Did I put my straw in here? I did not. I have 81 rye grains. Oh, hey, nice. <laughs> Beautiful. I forgot we had that much. Huh. Huh. Hmm. Crafting the flesh from four can be sown in the autumn. All right, so yeah, we've got plenty. We can reuse this for our next harvest, too. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Excellent. That's nice. So we got both food and harvest. Why did I come in here? Where's... Where's my straw? Uh... Was straw left in here? Ah, straw's in there. There we go. Oh, boy. oh I'm not over encumbered. I thought I did make me there for a moment, but nope. I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Uh, Dob. Oh, I don't have the tech yet. Oh, 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 God. When, oh, no. When do we get that? T oh, yeah, on our skill. All right, first, let's take care of this. All right, I'm all the way up on survival, so what do I want to do here? Cold wasn't a problem last winter. More health could be nice. Resistance to poisoning. Eh, just avoid eating things that'll, you know, poison you. Bigger fishing net limit. I don't have fishing nets yet. I would if I could. Take less damage. Oh, that's nice. Slower stamina consumption. Ah, uh, yeah, that sounds like a good one. I don't have the fishing nets. Well, how far until we get the fishing nets? Oh, God. Yeah, we don't even get that until we get the fishing hut. And oh, my God. How many points? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Yeah, the, the, oh boy, all right, all right, well, let's, let's take the stamina, the one then, yeah, there we go, we'll take that, god. And when do we get, I'm assuming it'd be in here, actually, maybe? Nope, I like skipped one, no, that's just all the weird fences we can make. No, all right, how do we make I mean, it's it's in the it's in the barn. Okay. Oh my God! Until we get the goose house, and I think I remember seeing that last time. Now, five hundred freaking farming points. Ah, uh -huh. again, just their balance of things. And uh, for his, I mean, Waddle and Dob is like one of the most common building materials used throughout the entirety of history. Why would we have to wait that long to know how to use it? <laughs> it's just things like that that bother, bother me with the, with historical knowledge. I mean, I understand, and some people have made the snarky comment when I made the knowing history and playing this game kind of thing. It's like, oh, shock and chagrin that a game isn't historically accurate. Of course, duh. But it's just stuff like that that bothers me when this is a many thousands of year old technology that anyone at this time would know how to make. Why do we have to wait until all the way down here to get it? That just seems crazy. And that it's in farming. It should really be in building. And like, maybe after the woodshed. Why is it in farming? I don't know. All right, well, let's put our supplies away then. I can't do anything with the clay yet, so. And it's stuff like that that gets to me. It really shouldn't 
be where it is, but no, yeah, well, that's what they chose to balance this game as, which doesn't seem balanced. I mean, early access, hopefully they mess with that stuff, but uh, okay, so in that case, oh boy, all right, we're 20 minutes in. You know what? Let's actually, I want to go find that other, that other clay deposit, so let's just keep our shovel. And let's roll this direction. Ooh, boy, I may need to make a new shovel. Well, we'll get what we can once we find the stuff. All right, so let's roll this way. And yay for slower stamina drain. Woo. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, well, there's lots of deer over here. That's nice. If only I had the freaking bow. But I don't. Oh, hi, Fox. How are you? <laughs> We're just chilling. Hi, hi, dear. How's it going, buddy? Don't mind me. I'm, I'm not here to mess with you. I'm just on my way to go get clay. Let's actually take a look at the map again here real quick. So it's supposed to be, like, here-ish, I think? Somewhere in there? All right, so let's follow this road for a bit. Hmm. <gasps> a stump. Oh, I could get a log from that. Nice. Also, whoop, 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 whoop. I think I found the clay area. Hey, found it. Let's collect until our shovel is dead. Which won't take long. Cons oh, hi, dear. H how's it going? <laughs> Don't mind me, just shoveling clay. Don't worry, I'm not going to murder you yet. I still got to make the arrows to make it more feasible to kill you. All right, there we go. Let's get this. And... Perfect. That one's floating a little bit. Oh, uh, well. And I'm assuming, like with most resources, next season this will be entirely recharged. Which would be good. So I'll just build like a little stockpile of clay for now until we get uh, the ability way down the freaking line to make daub. Ugh. <laughs> Seriously, that's Stone Age tech right there. Why the hell doesn't this person know how to make it? Oh, boy. Seriously, though, the, the makers of this game need, like, a historical consultant or something because, dear lord. Oh, no, we're not going to make it through this next one. I think I'm going to get, like, one, like, two or three hits in. Yep, maybe two. Yep, there it went. Well, can't collect that clay. All right, well, on our way back, let's just grab... Oh, I'm dirty now. Oh, no. Is that actually... Does that actually do anything to us if we're dirty? I've never let it get to, you know, like, real bad dirty phase. We always wash up before. Do we, like, get a disease or something? Because that'd be kind of a cool addition into the game if that was the case. I'm gonna grab rocks on the way home. Seems like a good plan. Then I'll make them a throw in rocks. 20 throwing rocks equals 200 gold, and that's pretty sweet. <laughs> all right, all right. Hey, I think next episode, we'll just go out adventuring into the wilderness to... Oh, I've been grabbing broadleaf plantains rather than the rocks I was trying to grab. <clears throat> I'll grab that. And the rock below it. And that rock. And what are we up to? Rock-wise? Let's see. Twelve? Okay. So yeah, next episode, I think we'll go try and find that cave just to see what it's all about. I mean, I kind of want to... You know, oh my god. I, I, just, I, just want, I just want the rock! There it is! <laughs> The crap. Oh my god, I grabbed every- I'm grabbing everything. You know what? While I'm here, might as well grab the other one since it had me grab all those anyways. <laughs> might as well hit the rest of the patch. But yeah, we'll go find the cave just because I'm curious. We'll load up with hunting equipment too to hunt on our way over there. And what do we got rock-wise? 17, three more rocks. Good, good. Alright, so let's roll over here. I'll grab the remaining three rocks closer, just in case it over-encumbers us. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, so that'll be, I think, a good plan. Not really much else we can do in this season. I mean, besides try and convince those one people to join our glorious farmstead. There we go, there's my 20 rocks. Nice. Uh, which we are gonna try again tomorrow. Which, man, since I got a uh, negative with that one lady, whew. May take another day to get her. <laughs> I think the guy that I'll be able to convince to come over here and we can get him to hunting, which hopefully will go well. 
And her we'll put in the food food storage shed because I mean he'll hunt. He'll I then I guess someone in the food storage shed will go grab the food people collect? Question mark? I have no idea. I have no idea. Then we'll have to build another house for a farmer. Someone to work the farm land and someone to work the barn, I believe, is how that'll go. You know what? We still got time here. Let's uh, drop off all of our 15 clay. Ugh. All right. And make the throne rocks. Go sell these. And that'll probably be it for this one. So there we go. A nice, good, solid 200 gold. Yeah, I need to figure out... And actually, I'm... Requ well, I don't know if you guys... The problem with me saying this is... Will the video... Will the video tomorrow come out at noon? So maybe I'll see the comments on that one before I record the next. Because I only have time to record one today. This is the first time this has ever happened with this game. Because typically... Like I, I usually say, I usually record a couple because I want to keep playing. I'm having fun despite all the complaints I have in this game. <laughs> I'm having fun with it. Uh, but yeah, I, I, I don't have a lot of time today, so I'm only recording one. So people, where can I buy the pickaxe to go and try and find metal? I Can I make the smithy yet? I don't think I can. I don't think I have, the, uh, have unlocked that. Oh yeah, we got to wash ourselves first. That'd be a good thing before we head out into the world. Don't want to walk by Erica smelling like just trash. That'd be awful. I mean, that'd just be... Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's wash up here. We'll grab some water, too, while we're here. I wonder, can we build a well? I don't know. I haven't noticed if that's a thing we can build. That should be a thing. That would be a cool thing to have added into the game. Especially if you want to build somewhere more inland. Alright, let's go sell these rocks real quick. And then that'll probably be it for this episode. But yeah, I haven't checked across the river if they... Uh, what they might sell differently. I know the one person sells, like, stuff from the geese that they got over there. And there's probably someone who sells food. I'm guessing one of the towns more in the south would be where I'd have to go to find, uh, to find that. I don't know for sure. All right, we'll go to Submir. He's right over here. Oh, boy. All right. Still really dislike that it uses stamina to stare at things. <laughs> Never in my... Hi, cow. You, um, doing all right there? Now, see, the price of the cow, that would actually make sense to me. I like the geese and stuff. I don't know. I don't know. All right, show me your wares, and more specifically, here, have a rock, and then the remaining 99 of them. Lovely. I'm almost back to a glorious thousand gold, which is enough to buy a goose. Not that I can actually do anything with the goose. Be cool if I could, though. Why am I still holding a throwing rock? Huh. Yeah, no, that's definitely gone. Uh... Something glitched! <laughs> I got a free throwing rock! Nice! I sold the others too! Oh, is the, that cow cheaper? Oh, he is, but only by 500. No, that's not worth it. The goslings, though. 1500 to 1200. Yeah, yeah. Buy a couple of goslings once I get one of those going. Oh, yeah, that's gonna be the way to go. Let's go see if I can hit a rabbit with my new magical rock that I have. Hi, folks. How's it going? Doing well over here with the farm? I see seeds planted. What you, what you growing? Let's see if we can find a rabbit and hit it with a rock. <laughs> you guys keep telling me to hunt with the small game with these, and I never do because, well, honestly, I actually haven't really been, hunt been hunting since I saw those comments, but. <laughs> uh, what do we got? I don't see a rabbit anywhere. Oh, I should go check my traps, though. So I actually may need to, ooh, yeah, we may want to grab some more. You know what? I'm going to put this away and see what happens. Yep, it's gone now. It's gone. <laughs> I had to check. I had to check. Oh, we lost a free rock. I need to grab some sticks, because we are going to need to redo both those traps, I believe. Oh, boop, boop. That was multiple sticks there. We'll do that before ending the episode today. All right. Got those. Oh, I didn't want the berry. I wanted the stick. Ah, oh, I got the berry now. No, I don't want the morels at the moment. Ooh, I want that rock, though. I need five. 
So one... Nope, that's not a rock I can hit. I mean, grab. I wonder if we could break those rocks up with a pickaxe once we get one. I don't know. All right, there's usually some rocks around here that I haven't picked up. And a stick, so that's two, three rocks. There we are. Nope, that's that's part of my barn. Four. Oh, crap, I need a fifth. All right, well, let's grab that. Got it. Yeah, one's dead, too. All right, one more rock. Oh, come on, rocks. Have I picked up all the rocks around my base? Oh, 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 oh. Rock. Beautiful. Okay, let's plop these back down, because these traps have been very useful to me. I wish they gave us more experience, but no, oh, well. All right, pop that there, and pop that one there. Lovely. All right, and what are we up to for feathers? We got 37 in there, four there. We're getting there, slowly but surely. All right, let's pop those in there, and these, lovely. Go put the meat in, in here, since we actually are next episode gonna be, oh, we're gonna be in summer, actually. I can do that next quest with Alwyn. Ooh, so here's the question. Do I do the next quest with Alwyn to, uh, next episode? Or do I go and look for the cave? I'll put that in there too, just because I can. <laughs> all right, all right. And yeah, that's going to be it for this episode. I'm going to chow down on all that meat in my inventory right now. It's not going to give me the most food ever, but there we go. That should sort us into the next season and into the next episode. So hopefully you all have enjoyed today and you do come back for the next win. I don't know, maybe we'll go look for a cave. But until that time, thank you for watching and as always, have a good one.